Okay, now let us get into this evidence. And with this evidence, it will show you how biased these news media houses are when they are reporting cases involving black people, right? We got to go there because it is just clear for us to see. Now, we have evidence to say that a man's severed head was found in a woman's freezer. Now, what I notice when they are reporting this case, it's all about the victim's criminal past. It's not about how gruesome this crime is. It's not about the mindset of the people who allegedly done the crime. Right? Let us get into the independent. Right? And the date is Friday the 26th of January 2024. A severed head was found in a woman's freezer. She insists she didn't put it there. After a harrowing discovery in her Brooklyn apartment, Ezra Steins alleged that her husband killed 39-year-old registered sex offender Kashin Geyser and dismembered his body. They make sure to let you know that even though these people cut up his body, put it in a freezer, oh, he was a sex offender, he has a criminal past, nothing to see here, right? And when it comes down to the independent, they make sure to just show the face of the victim. They don't show the faces of the alleged um, murderers. They don't show those faces. They only show the face of the victim and they make sure to let you know he has a criminal past. Right? No, you've got to ask critical questions. Right? That we could have neighbors that is capable of such a gruesome crime. You kill an individual and then you turn around, cut the body up, and put it in your freezer, right? What kind of mental state these people are in? And then to see the various media houses put such an emphasis on this man's criminal past and not the gruesome crime, right? It just shows you the time and season we are living in. People pay attention, right? And understand we wrestle not with flesh and blood. Wickedness in high places. We need to seek the faith of the Most High. Please go check this article out and others about this case. Right? Let us pray and say glory be to the Most High.